All right, guys, this is another one of those locks that Charles found in his father-in-law's toolbox. Um, his father-in-law worked for Con Ed back in the 80s, and he thinks maybe these locks came from there. And, you know, this chain kind of leads you down that path. This is an old Ilco. I don't know how long they've been out of business, but this lock is like it came off the factory yesterday. It wasn't in a box or anything, and it's got tiny pieces of very light tarnish on it, but all the edges are just beautiful. I mean, it's... Literally like it came off the production line. Uh, keys as well. Uh, this is the little split ring that usually comes with them. Two keys, but there's actually three here. Two of them from Ilco, and then one of them from a little company called yeah, Clover Brand. So they had an extra key made. Beautiful bidding on this guy. That's exactly what you want to see with that real deep one right there on the front protecting all those guys in the back. Um, it looks like it is a replaceable core, but I did open it earlier, and it is not. Oops, move that chain out of the way. Um, yeah, unfortunately, this is probably pinned in from, probably from this side to hold everything inside of there. So, it's a permanent installation of the core. The beauty of it is, if you take a look here, it's a ball bearing, so you can't shim it. So, that's a big plus. Two things going for this guy. Bidding and ball bearing. All right, let's see if we can't get into it. Um... Let's try this. I've opened Ilco's before. They like top of the keyway. It's got a nice wide open keyway. Not in their favor, but maybe a little bit in our favor. A lot of flop on this, but I'm going to try to hold it in my hand and do this. Let me grab a pick. Let's start out with a medium hook. This guy from the Praxis kit. All right, I will try to keep everything centered. Let's see what we got all the way in. Feeling for a binder, pin two, feels like, a nice click, I'll take it, pin one, does not want to budge, I'll leave him alone, pin four, I'm trying to get under him, maybe he doesn't want to budge either, I don't know, keep falling off the pin there, come on, get on there. Where are you? There we go. Pin four again. All right, pin five. I'm again. I'm having trouble get on, getting under him. I'm going to lighten up on my tension to squeeze the pickup around this corner. Let's try that. Nice click. I'll take it. All right, where are you? One definitely does not want to move. Three and four are definitely in. There we go. Four is the one. Pretty tough. Tougher than I thought it was going to be. Um, has a, it doesn't have a lot of wear on it, so still brand new. Nice and crisp edges and everything sharp inside of here. Anyway, this is going to be a giveaway, guys. Um... If you're a collector, the, I can't think of a better sample of an Ilco padlock uh, along with the original three keys with the original split ring. I know that's not going to be enough. Let me get my picks and stuff out of here. I'll show you what the giveaway will be this week. Definitely not that rat yoke. Um, I'm going to be giving away, along with this lock, you will get the Nano Kit from Lockpick World, um, from Vent, their version one of the credit card pocket pick. And last but not least, again, from Lockpick World, they've got this new thing. These are a nice little leather case, but uh, these are feeler gauges, two different thicknesses. One is 12,000, that would be this guy, and the other one is 7,000, almost like tin foil for decoding. That will be part of the bargain. You won't be able to use this on this lock, but maybe the rakes. Anyway, guys, appreciate your time. Stay safe, stay legal. You want to know how to register for the free giveaway? Stick around. I'll tell you how to do it. Thanks, guys. All you need to do is navigate to LockLab.com, the tribal website, and scroll down in the middle of the page. You'll see all the giveaway buttons, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. But the one you're looking for is the Weekend Review Giveaway, Purple Band. Just click on it. It'll take you to the registration page. Again, scroll to the bottom, put in a good email address. So if you win, I can get in touch with you, let you know. Put in a username, doesn't matter what it is, and click Submit. When you're done, you'll get a green check mark confirming your entry. Thanks, guys.